sun, it should have experienced a gravitational deflection of about 16 degrees. If the rotational axis did not change between July and December, the original sun-facing pole is now on the night side of 3I Atlas, opposite to the direction of the sun, meaning that this prominent anti-tail shouldn't exist anymore. At this point, the original anti-tail is now pointing in the same direction as the weaker jet in the new Hubble images from December 12th through the 27th and is accompanied by a stronger sunward jet from the opposite side of 3I Atlas on its way out of the solar system. Once again, this absolutely shouldn't be happening. You shouldn't get a duplication of the same kind of jet if different sides of the object are facing the sun after the perihelion close approach with the sun. But that's exactly what is happening.